call a session to uh, elect a new Senate president, and we'll be doing that shortly. Uh, and though my, as I said, my initial thoughts were that this um, conflict would be uh, no different than conflicts facing other senators, um, you know, there is merit in that argument that uh, the office of Senate president has many more challenges, and I think the ethics laws that we have work well for uh, the senators and uh, legislators and representatives in general, but uh, probably for people in leadership, just needs to be a little more acute attention paid. So uh, made that decision yesterday. Uh, very comfortable with it. Um, upon reflection, it's the right thing to do. And uh, when you know what the right thing to do is, you do it. So that's it. Fire away. Ben. What helped you reach this decision? Were there conversations with Republican senators? Or? Nope. Um, I met with um, a couple of senators uh, yesterday. Well, I'll say I met with Senator Morrison and Odell uh, yesterday afternoon. Um, and they had wanted to discuss the situation and, you know, how best to, to respond to questions and things like that. And I started the meeting basically by saying, you know, I'll save a lot of time in discussion to let you know I've decided I'm going to step down. Um, and so the only tricky decision now is... Uh, um, how to go about that process. So that kind of, uh, kind of stopped the, the discussion right there. And, uh, you know, they, they're both in agreement that was the right thing to do. And, uh, and again, as I said, I, I think those who work with me know that I try my utmost to maintain transparency, openness, and integrity, and, and all that happens in the Senate. I've worked to nurture that over the last three years. Um, and so I don't think anybody was thinking that I would um, fall prey to any temptation, but I think uh, the potential is there and the perception is there that the potential is there, and I think the perception part of it is, is the key.